And hello everybody, today I will be showing you how to do some basics on Delphi. So let's get to it. Okay, so first thing you want to do is you want to open a new BCL form. Okay, so this is not necessary, but I enjoy to make my GUI bigger. Okay, so first thing you want to do is add an edit. Okay, then if you want, you can add a label to your GUI. Okay, so now add a button. Now let's add a memo. Okay, so this is not necessary, but I'm going to add a bit button as well. Okay, now before we go on, let's do some basics. Okay, so this is your input. This will be the process. And this will be your output. Okay, now let's edit the label's caption. Make it name so that it will show name later. Now let's change the edit's name to EDT name. Okay, now let's remove all the text inside of the edit. I'm just going to change the layout of the GUI so it looks a little bit better. Okay, now I'm going to change the name of the bit button to bit btn help. And now I'm changing the kind to help. Okay, so now I'm just going to remove the whole caption. Now I'll change the memo's name to mem output. And I suggest that you erase the lines. Now it's time for the button. I suggest that you change the name to BTM Enter. And after that change the caption to just Enter. Now we can start with the coding. Double tap on the button. Now let's add some variables. Add a variable is name and then next to it string. Now underneath begin write is name becomes edt name dot text. Now let's go straight to the output. Write mem output dot lines dot add. Okay, so this is not necessary, but you can make your memo say name before the output itself. Just type what I'm typing here right now. Now just add plus is name. Now remember to always put this after your line of code to show Delphi that you're finished with that line. Now let's edit the bit button. We are going to make a message pop up whenever a user clicks on it. So write show message, then in brackets write what you want the user to see when they click on it. Now let's test everything by running the project. Now I'm inputting my name into the box and then wow the output is there. Now let's save. Okay so go to file, say save all. Now create a new folder. You can name it whatever you want. Now name the unit, let's go frm whatever underscore u. Same thing with the project but on the end instead of a u give it a p. Now 
Now to line your things up, say Ctrl plus D. Now let's improve the look of our GUI. I will be adding another label. Now let me show you how to change the font of the label. Now let's change the color of the form. Now let's change how it opens up as a window. Now let's change where it opens up. I like it when it is maximized as a window, so I will be changing it back. And that is all for this episode, and goodbye guys, see you later.